today I have been so busy doing stuff but guess what I'm here and I'm doing a vegan side dish yes I don't know it's just that everybody who looks at my videos do not eat my food and I had such good comments from a lot of good supporters out there who be like Miss T I can't eat your food cuz I'm a vegan but I just love your personality and spirit and can you please do a vegan dish? My cousin came here like a week ago. Her co-worker followed me, said, could you ask your cousin to do a vegan dish? So this is not my personal recipe, my personal thing. I did my research and I know vegans, no animal-based products, foods or dairy or something like that. So I'm doing what you call chickpeas, but I'm gonna amp it up with some curry flavor. So it's gonna be a curry chickpea side dish. So it's going to be um, curry chickpeas. That's what the video say, right? Let's get to it. I'm using coconut oil. You don't have to use coconut oil. You can use water if you like, just to saute those um, onions and this garlic down, or you can use vegetable oil. I'm going in with a quarter onion and one clove of fresh garlic, finely chopped. Ooh, let me take this off. And guys, I'm just going to let this sweat up a little bit. You don't want your dog to burn. I don't use a quarter onion. If you like, because it's only one can of chickpeas. Of course, guys, you need your onions. Or your can of chickpeas, make sure you drain the juice off of it. Okay? A quarter onion, one clove of garlic, two tablespoons of curry powder, two tablespoons of tomato paste, and some fresh parsley, and some water, and... Coconut oil, if you coconut oil, if you decide to use it to cook with, it smells so amazing. And this is this is a quick side dish. It's not going to take that long to make. I mean, you can eat it by itself. It could be a side dish or by itself. This coconut oil smells amazing. Never used it before. Maybe I'll try to find chicken in it and see what happens. I don't know. Okay. But that being said. That's cooking itself up. I'm gonna go in with actually just a teeny bit of water on top of here to cool it down. See right here, I'm using this is a half a cup of water, guys, but it's down now to one fourth because I put some water in here. Two tablespoons of tomato paste. That's all I'm using. Mmm. I never smelled coconut oil before. Never dreamt of cooking with it, and it smelled amazing. Two tablespoons of curry powder. And I'm just gonna stir it up. It makes like a sauce. I'm gonna go in with a little bit more water. Actually, the rest of my water. Try to get that tomato paste all diluted in there. Okay. And guess what? Go in with my chickpeas. Chickpeas. <laughs> One Oh! Look at that. <laughs> One can of drained chickpeas. And I'm just going to put them on top of each other just like this. And I'm going to let it simmer for about 10 minutes, you guys. And this will be ready. It smells so awesome. And I'm going in with some fresh parsley. I love this green stuff. You know. And you can use this in every day. Oh God, this smell. This smells good. It actually do. I don't know if it's the curry powder or the um the tomato paste, but this smells so awesome. Guys, and I'm gonna let this go. I'm going to add just a teeny bit of more water because I don't want it too thick, but I don't want it too loose. So that was a half a cup of water that I used in all total. Just a little, maybe two tablespoons. Two more tablespoons. So one cup in 
two tablespoons. <laughs> That's what I'm going to tell you guys. Oh my goodness, it smells so good. It really do, and I'm not exaggerating. If you like chick chickpeas, I gotta say it very carefully. If you like chickpeas and you like carry, the flavor that it's gonna give, give it is amazing. I'm gonna let this simmer for about 10 minutes, come back and play with you guys. So guys, this dish is for all my vegan fans out there. Thank you for supporting. Hey, look at this. This is ready. It's quick, it's simple. I'm supporting you guys because you guys are supporting me. Again, this is not my personal recipe. I did a lot of research and I hope I did it justice. But guys, I'm going to plate this. I don't know if I got to take it in the house. But it's simple, it's easy. Um, how to make vegan carry chickpeas, you know. And I'm just going to take a little bit of, um, wow. Sam Fufu, having that parsley right there. Guys, I'm just going to take and sprinkle. You know, presentation is key. A little bit of fresh parsley on top of here, you guys. So, this is my take on a vegan dish. I hope you guys like it. Share and subscribe. This is how to make vegan what I say this is, carry this curry. How to make curry chickpeas vegan style. So I hope you guys love it. Share, subscribe. Hey, don't forget to check out my other channel, Soulful T2. Don't forget to check out Brandon Reaction Channel. Everything is in the description box for you guys. Thank you so much. I'm out of here. Oh, I forgot to say, Soul Squad. <laughs> I got to let you guys know I got love for you. I gotta wash up. Guess what? Oh my god, this smells great. The steak. Okay, right on top of here.